Hello everyone, I'm Bizit Thapa and welcome back to my channel. Today I'm back with a new creative and fun video where I'll be uh, learning and making a filter for Instagram and Facebook. So I have not uh, tried it uh, before. I just saw uh, saw an ad from Meta or Facebook on my news feed uh, where uh, they were giving a free uh, Spark AR uh, course on how to create Instagram uh, like filters on uh, Instagram and Facebook. So I was interested because I think it's uh, going to be a new uh, skill that will be valuable in future like uh, digital uh, what do you call this digital marketing uh, these days. So I have just uh, done some research or I have just opened a page about Spark Air and downloaded it. I still need to install it. So and I will try to create a, I will try to create a filter for Instagram and Facebook and upload it on upload it uh, and this filter uh, will be related to Nims Dai. Uh, Nimsta is celebrity uh, for us, for Nepali and for almost all the people around the world because he have uh, climbed uh, 14 peaks that are higher than or uh, taller than 8000 meters in just 7 months. Uh, that's a world record and his movie is also uh, premiering in November 29th I think. Uh, so I'll try to make a filter uh, related to him and deploy it on Facebook and Instagram okay. So let's go ahead and install our Spark AR Studio so you can download it for free. Just go to sparkair.facebook.com and from there download it and here I have downloaded I will show in finder I will have to minimize the screen I will just bring my downloads here and here is the download file so I'll open it and install it first and then we will try to figure out things and create the application okay so to learn this application to uh, know how to use it I just uh, searched the term spark AR on YouTube and I found out this cool and short tutorial by Ben Marriott and I found it easy so I'll be following him and I'll create a tutorial for us okay so I think our application is, is installed I will close it now and that's it so let's go and open our spark ar studio so it will open so i was talking about this tutorial so i found this was the first tool i ever watched just a couple couple of minutes ago and i found it easier and so i will be uh, using or uh, i'll be following this tutorial and create filter okay so for this filter i have i am planning to use uh, this uh, vector uh, of mountain it is a mount everest i searched for a mount everest vector on google and i found out this one and i will use this kukuri cross vector icon as well so it will be some kind of a tattoo filter on our face so let's see how it goes i don't know how it will be because it's my first time trying to create an AR filter okay so where is our AR studio so here is our AR studio uh, we can either log in with Facebook log in with Facebook to get started so I will log in SMS with login code, please enter the code below. So I have received the code, I'll just log in now. 506 725. So that's it. So this is it. I will just skip because I will be following uh, our tutorials. So we can minimize, we can maximize it as well so first thing we need to do we need to go to create new project and we'll be doing i think blank project so let's follow the tutorial i'll go back and watch the tutorials and let you know okay so 
so let's create a blank project i'll click on blank project and then so this is a, a simulation video where you can test your effect so if we go up here where is it so we need to go to add object here and from here we will use face mesh so we just need this face mesh and then we will insert it and like this this comes here and based on this face mesh we will be creating our filter okay and then we need to go to materials and on this material let's click on plus icon and this white paint things come comes up and on the right side material here we have a silver thing so call it so let's rename it and call it uh, tattoo material that's it so first let's go to let's download the face assets uh, where is it we do not have face asset here so i'll just have to search on download face asset for spark yeah so i'll just search download face asset for spark AR. that's it and here hope i'll get that face asset you are talking about face reference asset face reference asset so face reference asset so here is our download so i will explore that folder let's open our folder and here we have face asset and we need to add we need the textures what we really do is here we have textures inside our face assets so if you see here we have different multiple images so the first one is this is face for feminine face for masculine face mesh and just some things assets so we will use this to create our tattoo so we will just import it on uh, photoshop and then create our tattoos okay so let's close it for now and let's open our photoshop and there based on this image we will create our tattoo okay so let me open uh, photoshop so here is our photoshop so i'll open the file here masculine face masculine file here it's taking some time so this is it so here we will uh create tattoos so here we will paste some items and uh, check how it looks okay so as i have told you earlier i have i want to use this mountain and kukuri cross on our face as a tattoo so i will download it save image as uh okay mount Everest logo vector desktop okay save and kukuri cross save image as uh kukuri cross desktop okay save close both and let's go back to photoshop and here uh, we need to look for our those files so let's go to desktop and then these two so i will drag and drop these two items here and let's press enter 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 and i think but we could not import our vector i don't know why I could not this is on way P so that's why it's not important so what we can do is so we can open it like this and then take a screenshot of this one so let me just minimize it looks horrible when screen is larger so I'll just take a screenshot come on see four and let's take a screenshot up to here i'll take a screenshot and we'll just use that so here is my screenshot so i'll open it here okay press enter for now i will just and we need to convert both of them to rasterize so right click and let's rasterize layer first so this will also be rasterize layer mm -hmm. i will just hide uh, the mountains for now and we need to remove this white space as well so i'll use this one sorry command d we need to go to kukuri mm, select this one and let's delete so i'll delete 
so command D and it's gone and same we need to do the same for our mountains as well so let's open the mountain select it sorry I need to go to the mountains layer select it then sorry so we need to add it click here add add and we did it so everything we got we just have this uh, png format mountain so we will use I think I will put my text just above the eyebrows. Eyebrows, so I will resize them. I want it to be here, up here. I don't know much more about tattoo, so I will try my best to make it as good as possible. Okay, let me know in the comment below how it, how it should have been. Okay, so. I don't have any tattoos and I want to but I I yet I don't have I think uh, this is okay what do you think guys I think this looks nice then we will open our cookery and then also resize it I want it to be on this stick here so, minimize it. Okay, I think size is perfect. And here we will write like 14 pick 7 season means die. Okay, so I will just write it. Let's say 14 picks 7 month. Okay, so we need to arrange the text so it should be on black color. And let's increase the size and we will change the font as well. So uh, let's arrange the height first and then this, I think this will be uh, bigger and we will also so I want it to be here so let's bring it down and we'll just try to make it as good as possible and okay so now let's select it and zero this will be uh, 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 uh. so we'll change the font font face as well so for that I will select it let's check the font so I don't know which one looks better or we'll just check the font and select one okay so uh, let's select one font. I don't know which one is good. Let's go and check. This doesn't look nice. Neither this one. So you look for the font for tattoos or something cool. I don't know what font looks cool on tattoos. So let's go with this font instead. I don't know how good is it. I just want to try 14 picks. So, okay, let's go with this one. This must be horrible selection, right? I'm not that good on this type of tattoo font selections. I just, I'll just use it. I think this will be good. Let's go with normally or something like that. I think normal is okay. We just need to decrease the opacity. I will go with 80 percent opacity for every thing. So let's go with 80 percent opacity for mountain for Kokuri as well. I'll go with 80 percent opacity. So let's see, is it good or not? I don't know how actual tattoo color looks. So I'm just guessing things. I think we should move Kokuri a little bit towards left. Okay, so. So let's move our Kukuri a little bit towards left. Okay. 
I think that looks fine for us and I'll go with this this kind of tattoo okay tattoo uh, Mount Everest tattoo over the eyebrow and the long left cheek we will have kukuri and on right we will have 14 peaks 7 month names die okay now we need to create it as png so I will minimize it and we will just save it as png okay so export as quick export as png so okay let's go to desktop and names by tattoo and then let's save it I will and then minimize this Photoshop and let's go to desktop and if we see here is the PNG file that we created for our tattoo okay so I'll close it so what we can do is now we can we can just drag and drop that image or that PNG file inside our materials so I will drag and drop this PNG file okay and here we have our tattoo now we need to use it if we select this and in texture which is texture here in texture we can now we can select our names the tattoo texture okay so if I select it so it looks like this so this is how it looks Fukuri on left side names the tattoo on right side and on for on just over the eyebrows we will have some mountains okay so I will try it on my face as well and I will show you as well okay so so let's test on some other faces as well so here I will go with this one this girl it looks nice and this guy as well it's nice and it's nice as well so if we go here we can just build down the opacity to match the to match with the skin color and we just increase its size yeah 14 picks 7 months seems like equally and then mountain over here that's it guys we have successfully created a tattoo filter for our facebook and instagram so now i'll try to uh, publish it on facebook and instagram and check it out so i'll uh, if it was if it's possible i will just share the link for this tattoo and uh, just give me a feedback about this uh, learning and creating sessions did, if, if you like it or if you did not like it or if there are any better resources and should I keep continuing making such videos or uh, should I keep continuing uh, continue creating uh, such AR filters so just let me know in the comment below now I will try to publish it so first I will go to here and where is export publish here is publish and publish new effect so first i will export we need to export let's export save as okay so let's add let's save as let's die tap to they are and i'll save it on desktop and save so names die ar export so I have on desktop so I think I need to go to spark AR hub to upload this to publish this spark AR hub and then I will just uh, publish Air effect spark air uh, Instagram and Facebook so so this is the place I think so let's get started spark air hub let's publish effect mm -hmm. let's die let's die 14 picks okay I will just uh, use it and let's drag and drop I choose file we need to go to desktop 
then where is it name style tattoo air export open that's a select platform all platform uh, instagram facebook messenger owner is me uh, on all publisher on all platform okay uh, appearance selfies Personal pieces of media internal sports team. Let's say fandom as well. It's four, okay. So, let me skip the work of not surrounded for the modes. Not mode. This is. I think that's it. That's the four uh, categories I will use. Optional include particular themes or object. Let's say. Uh, let's die. Uh, everything is. Possible then is face tattoo sorry face tattoo face tattoo names thy names thy AR names thy filter names thy tattoo so here I need so kind of so good so case your effects I can please capture your video directly from Instagram or spark AR studio don't use stock videos of regular image don't modify boomerang your video don't apply so I need to open uh, this effect on I need to capture the video and then upload it here so for now I'll just up I'll just capture the video and upload it okay and, and here if I 200 by 200 pixel and this will be icon okay so let's create the icon first I'll just create icon so this is done command N so here so here I will create a new document let's say 500 by 500 pixel and I will call it I will go with orange color I think if I use this orange color on its project possible or something like this. I'll go with uh, our backspace and let's see let's add n for name style and this will be uh, is it it will will it be on good on black or white let's go with uh, white and I will use Oswald how does Oswald look Oswald gold I'll go with Oswald World Command T uh, and I think we should not use elongated instead use poppins uh, poppins let's use this one okay I'll use this logo or uh, this icon and save on your computer desktop and the icon I'll save it as jpeg save and ok save let's go back again and then upload it so here choose file I'll search for names die AR okay. Okay. Okay, so this is John names die and here I need to create a video here. So I will have to just I'll just close I'll just minimize it and I will go back to another screen and here I may have like I may be able to turn on computer camera okay so you may not have seen the tattoo but so this is how tattoo looks like on my face so this is it so I have recorded the video from my phone but I don't know whether it will allow to use it or not so let me share the files and we will try it okay 
so I don't know how it looks it might not look that great but it's my first ever it's my first AR or first my effect ever so let me open so if I get info 30 MB so this is okay I think I guess so how is it okay so I will upload this video and try it out whether it works or not okay so let me rename this as well Rename the okay so let's go back and I will choose file I can here names die sorry not here download and download go to um, names die air effect choose and I'm uploading it so case if you physically capture every directly from Instagram Facebook or Spark AR Studio I'm doing it from Spark AR Studio but I'm using my mobile phone hope it will allow me to upload okay otherwise i will try again i think video is up okay why is it having problems huh? make sure you upload you upload or demo video that was recorded in portrait mode and isn't rotated so guys uh i'll try my best to uh, publish uh this effect action as possible and i'll let you know so if you have watched this video till the end then thanks so much for watching hope you enjoyed it if you want to make this if you want me to make such videos uh, quite often then please like this video and if you have any queries or if you have any feedback done then please let me know in the comment below so this is uh, telling me to make some changes so i will uh, try my best to make all the changes and upload the video and publish it so fingers crossed hope everything goes well a few moments later okay guys now my video is finally ready uh, so now my video is accepted so i'll i'm going to publish it soon so all i have to do is first i had to click on this test on device and then from here i needed to add experiences uh, it's for making it available on instagram facebook uh, for sharing on social media as well as for creating ads uh, etc uh, and also it also can be used on video calling so i had to add all of those things and i send it to my mobile phone so it sent directly to my mobile phone so that i can test it and from my mobile phone using the facebook app i had to create the video and then submit it so finally i have created the video uh, after getting that link on my facebook and uploaded it and now it's available now it accepted and now i will publish it and fingers crossed uh, hope it will be accepted and it will be uh, publicly available for everyone to use so that's it guys if it's published and made available hope it will be viral and everyone uses it uh, so if you if you ever get chance to use or uh, test this uh what do you call test this skin or test this tattoo effect then please uh, create a video or take a snapshot and send it uh, to my instagram or on facebook or uh, tag me on instagram or facebook okay so that's it your effect is now in review hope it will be accepted so that's it guys see you soon on new tutorial or on new video something like this sound funny or some creative or some uh, fruitful video so till then stay safe take care see you soon bye bye